Hello all, my name is Krishna Hack and welcome to my vlogging channel. So guys, today in this particular video, I'm going to discuss about this platform which is called as eLitmus. Uh, this particular platform will be pretty much handy for off-campus placements. And uh, you know, when I talk about off-campus placements, that basically means it will be very, very good for those people, for those freshers who are basically from third tier college, you know. And uh, if I talk about this specific platform, guys, they have a lot of tie up with different, different MNCs, you know, bigger MNCs, which provides you some very good salaries. Now, if I talk about uh, and I have also written this particular exam in this particular platform when I passed out from my college. So it is a very old platform. I passed out somewhere around 2011 and I had written this specific exam. Uh, because I was also from a tier 3 college, but anyhow, I got placed in HCL. So I stopped. Uh, I, I actually gave this entire exam. I got somewhere around 78 percentile for this particular exam. I'll talk about what percentile you should basically get so that you'll be able to get calls from this kind of companies. You know, they will actually uh, tell you to come and attend the interview. And uh, usually the e-litmus exam is decided based on some kind of percentiles. You know, now when I say percentiles, then first of all, you need to understand that when you take the specific test of e-litmus, uh, the percentile, the minimum percentile that you should be getting should be at least 80 percentile. Okay. If you are getting more than 80 percentile, then definitely you have a good chance of getting interview calls from various companies because they have a lot of tie up with this kind of companies. Now, the next thing many people ask me that Krish, what kind of questions are asked in this specific test of e litmus? It is very much simple guys, mostly aptitude, aptitude with respect to maths and quant aptitude. Okay. So that is the reason I also say for the people when you are actually in the college, you know, if you feel that you are from tier three colleges, probably you'll not be able to get any companies. I think this platform will be pretty much amazing. Uh, if I talk about 2020, many, many people have got placed, many, many freshers have got placed in various companies in this specific platform. Now in the left hand side here, you can see, uh, they will give you the entire patterns like when the hiring is happening by which all companies now in this particular you can see essential is basically hiring on 24th june beep cart is 30 on 13th of june harman 12th of june and all and when i talk about these all companies uh yes essential gives you a normal salary but other companies here you can see all the other details like essential will be giving you four lakh fifty thousand beep card may give you this much salary Associate engineer may give you this much salary. Uh, I mean, Harman may will give you this much salary. So they have provided all the specific details. Now, once you write the e-litmus test, then you will be getting a percentile based on the performance of the test. And remember, guys, in e-litmus test, you all you have a negative marking also. So if you are trying to apply, probably there will be somewhere around some set of questions. Just try to have a look on the pattern. I don't remember the pattern because I had written this particular exam in 2011. Okay, so uh, when you write this particular exam, please make sure that how many questions are there and you try to solve it smartly because it has negative marking. If you are able to get more than 85 percentile, 80 percentile and if you try to apply in this specific companies, then you will definitely get a call for with respect to the interviews uh, to attend it. Okay, the most and the important thing is that try to get good percentiles and once you write a specific test, okay, suppose you write this specific test, I'll just show you over here. Mm -mm. Suppose if you write this specific test, probably for June 6th, if you write this particular test, okay, so he, they'll tell you to log in and register for it. I think the fees is very much minimal for writing this particular test. Once you get the percentile that is valid for at least I think one year, you know, so for for the upcoming one year, you can apply for as many as companies that you will be seeing that uh, the companies will be hiring over here. Okay, I've shown you how to basically, uh, 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 you know, look for this specific companies and hire it, right? So if you go over here, just go over here and see the date, see the package, you know, and just try to apply. Now in this particular case, you can see over here, software engineer zero to four years. Now this is just not, uh, uh, this is just not with respect to only freshers a professional also can apply you know suppose he is having two years experience three years experience and probably you think that you want some better salary you want uh, job offers from some bigger companies from some amazing startups which can give you some amazing packages then definitely you should have uh, try it out okay and this is probably a best platform 
Uh, similar one more platform is there uh, like eLitmus which is called as AmCat also. Uh, I had also given AmCat uh, because uh, in my college they had actually told me to give uh, the aptitude test for both eLitmus and Am AmCat. For eLitmus I got 78 percentile which was very very much less but till then I got placed in some MNCs so I did not focus on more writing the test again. Okay. Uh, so here you can see fresher jobs, experienced jobs, you know, so here just imagine 47 lakhs and above CTC would be if stock upside ends up higher, referral reward is this much. So you got by DD. Okay, so you can apply for this kind of jobs. Okay, and not only this guys, you will be getting roles with respect to software engineers, with respect to AI ML engineers, with respect to senior associate, with respect to software development engineering, with respect to software engineering and many more things, right? So there is no such limit as such, uh, but many job requirements that comes for freshers will be definitely seen over here. And the track record of clearing the interviews is also pretty much good if you are able to get better percentiles at least more than 85 percentile and if i talk about the syllabus guys you really need to be good at aptitude uh, quant uh, aptitude and you, you have to be also uh, very very good at uh, you know english aptitude that we basically learn you know you can just check out the syllabus over here in this particular uh, they'll, they'll provide you the syllabus and all and you can actually have a look onto this entire, entire platform so if you feel that you are a fresher you are from third tier college and probably you will not be getting any campus placement this can also be one option please make sure that as a college student you always prepare for data structures algorithm competitive programming aptitude and try to write this kind of exams in e-litmus or uh, uh, at least try with e-litmus you know forget about the other platforms okay and whatever things you actually like so just try to prepare in this particular way try it from your second year Trust me, you'll be able to crack the interviews anywhere, right? So I hope you like this particular video. Please do subscribe to the channel if you have not already subscribed. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a great day. Thank you one and all. Bye-bye.